Hi, hi guys, this is Scott again. Um, got a question for everybody. What happens when you go on to Gun Broker and you see a model gun you like and you place a bid on one and then you go down and go, you know what, I'm just, I'm not going to win, but, you know, here's another one. I'll put a bid on that one too, just for the heck of it, to see what happens. Well, i tell you what happens. What happens is you end up getting a fantastic new Beretta, the X4 Storm, in full size. And then you end up getting another Beretta PX4 Storm in the compact size. Yeah, I kind of got carried away. But you know what? I'm really thrilled about it. Um, the PX4 Storm, as many of you know, is the Beretta's uh, entry into the polymer world. And it's a fantastic gun. Um, you have a three dot sight. Amb ambidextrous safety, um, a uh, magazine release that can be switched from left side or right side uh, with a simple push thing, uh, push of a button. Um, some of the easiest takedowns of any gun. Oops, let me drop, drop the magazine. Out. There we go. Oh yeah, and for all you safety sallies, yeah, it was loaded, um, but. Nothing in the chamber. Uh, everybody can get over it. Um, once again, easy, easy take down. You just pull these two levers down, slide it right off. There you go. Uh, when I got this gun, it was absolutely caked in um, some kind of grease that made it super slick. But the problem is, is that it was catching dirt, grime, and everything. It had literal grit on it. So, uh, got that cleaned out, and now we're ready to roll. So, this is probably going to be, my hope is, to use this five, the full-size gun um, as a um, IDPA gun, okay, um, and use the compact as a daily carry. Uh, this holds 17 rounds, the full-size full does. It has a four-inch barrel, um, and um, it has the unique rotating barrel. I don't know if you guys can see that. But I'm trying to make it work. Um, so, uh, really cool hammer firing. Okay, so unlike Hickok 45, who loves, as he tells us every time he turns around, the um, the um, Oh gosh, you know what I'm talking about, the firing pin thing where it just, uh, the striker fire. Um, this has a hammer, and um, I like it better with a hammer. I can choose if I want to do double or single. That's my choice. It's not chosen for me. So, um, once again, love the full size. Now, compact is... 15 round 9 millimeter okay three dots once again hammer hammer drop safeties um, change out the uh, uh, magazine release um, slide oh by the way slide on the the um, compact the uh, slide slide release is also um, ambidextrous. There's one on each side. Um, also, another unique thing on this is that it has a slight different um, on its takedown. It has a slightly different. Let me hang on. Here it goes. Um, it has a slightly different piece on it that's right here. That is not. It's like a shroud that covers the uh, spring or the guide rod in the spring. So uh, that's a little different uh, than in than on the uh, full size. Full size does not carry that. So I thought that was interesting. Uh, when I got this gun, as opposed to being uh, 
all greased out and everything. This one was actually bone dry, so I had to uh, um, redo it tonight. Uh, I just got it today. Uh, I've had the other one for a week or so. Uh, but anyway, this is my two toys. Um, I've got a new Beretta too, another new Beretta. Uh, the uh, the uh, Neos, uh, which I think you I have a video of, of my wife and I shooting. So, um, long story short, now I have my I have five Berettas at this point. So, uh, uh, one of the guys in the gun club asked me a while back if I was going to be a Beretta snob, and I said, yeah, pretty much. So, um, that being said, guys, um, take care, be safe, and when you're bidding on uh, gun brokery, be careful. You'll end up having... Uh, situation like me where I had to come up with some cash that I wasn't planning on. Uh, bottom line, that uh, I'm super happy um, with what I got and uh, I'm going to have a whole lot of fun with these. So y'all take care and be safe and uh, bye.